Hey tubers, well here we are on uh, Tuesday and a friend of mine called me up and uh, of course he's he's got three little kids and he needed some room for uh, for the bikes. So he called me up and I uh, said that he bought a shed and uh, of course he's not here right now because he's at work. So I told him I'd go pick it up. Fortunately he didn't give me all the details to it. So uh, what do you think Pa? Are you having fun yet? You working hard today or what? Always having fun. Sid, what you doing, baby girl? Are you hard at work? So we're, we got the Denali out here. Of course, we uh, like to use the Denali for pretty much everything. Isn't that right, Pa? Come on, smile for the camera here. Say, no. say cheese. We say don't cheese. go on camera anymore. No camera? Not since, not since that last thing, I guess. So here we are, and we uh, brought the trailer along here. And we got the shed on the trailer. So it's, uh, it's bigger than it looks. It's uh, eight and a half by uh, ten or something. So there we go. There's the little Denali, and there is the big shed. It's a pretty good load. Remember when you're uh, carrying stuff to make sure you get proper axles and load. We got uh, some blocks here, so it can't slide one way or the other. That would suck. And underneath we kind of put some corner bracing there. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. And some straps in the corner to tie off. X bracing for the middle. Set of doors there in the front. You should always make sure that the uh, they're screwed shut because uh, if you don't screw them, it's a real prick. Kind of keeps it wobbling and uh, going down the road. Doors flying open, never a good scene. And also here, we've got the little window and a side door here. Once again, screwed shut and latched. No, no door back here though, so uh, she's a little bit wide, wider than a trailer, but uh, should be okay. Crazy. And uh, thir 13.6 clearance, we got about 12.6, so we got lots of room there. We got her all strapped off, all four corners, strapped off and braced from the inside, so uh, should be okay. We're not overloaded or nothing, probably weighs a couple thousand pounds, I'm thinking. Looks a little strange, the old house getting pulled by the Denali, so the Swiss Army knife for trucks, gotta love the Denali. If you're gonna buy, buy Denali. This thing does it all. Now it's in the towing business, I guess, but uh... all right, Sid, say goodbye to the tubers. Say goodbye, Sid. Are you saying Sid. goodbye? Goodbye, Sid. <laughs> all right, talk to you guys later. Hopefully you like this video. Hopefully we get it off. We should show some videos of us dropping it off, and hopefully it's not falling off, so talk to you after.